Tokyo is a project funded by the European Horizon 2020 program. And uh, we are funded uh, for 6 million euro to achieve an objective to try to find a treatment or a cure for two different muscle diseases, namely myotubular myopathy and Pompe disease. Myocure is essentially can be divided into two parts. The word myo means muscle and the objective of myocure is to cure muscle disease and that's why we call it myocure. Myocure is very unique in the sense that it consists of a big consortium which uh, consists of eight different institutes all over Europe coming from five different European countries and all together we are going to contribute our expertise to make sure that the objectives are met at the end of the four years. So my task as a coordinator is to make sure that we manage to disseminate all uh, our information to as many stakeholders as possible. But our really important final task is to make sure that the Mayokyo objective is met at the end of the four years and we would like to get uh, approval from orphan drug designation so that we can move on to a phase one clinical trial to treat uh, the two diseases. The main expertise of our institution, the Free University of Brussels, consists of developing what we call molecular turbochargers. These are like powerful engines that we need to boost the performance of our gene therapy. So far we are very pleased with the progress that has been achieved within Myocure. There are actually two challenges. One challenge consists of delivering the therapeutic gene into the right target cell. And this is not so simple. You need to identify the right molecular key to open the door, and we think we have found that key. The second thing is, once the gene is inside the cell, it has to do its job properly, and there's a lot of tweaking that needs to be done, and we think we have nailed it, and that we have optimized the, the way to maximize the performance of our gene therapy. The next steps that we need to really focus on is to uh, improve the way that we manufacture these new therapies. This is challenging in its own right and it's going to be an essential step towards the uh, ultimate orphan drug designation uh, application for these particular gene therapies. Uh, another important step is to really prove that our products are superior to what's out there.